Hello there everyone, Joseph here, and welcome back to some more IL-2 Great Battles with Dietrich Mueller flying the Ju-87 over the Battle of Stalingrad. We are now on the 27th of August, 1942, and our mission is to bomb a railway junction. That should be easy, right? Right. <laughs> Alright, so let's, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and go through these guys and then I'll join you on the briefing screen. Alright then, here we are on the briefing screen. As you can see here, our target's up here along this railroad. Pretty open space, so we're bombing just the track? Huh? Maybe there's something. There must be a, like a temporary railroad junction or something out there. We are flying over quite a few AA pits from the looks of it, mainly the front line there. Uh, so, we'll be doing that. Our loadout for today. Now, I am a little bit different than everyone else. Uh, everyone else is at 65% fuel and they're carrying the SC500. I'm taking out the 1000 kilogram bomb. I almost said pound, <laughs> 1000 kilogram bomb, um, with additional armored plating as well, because that always helps. So I'm taking a bit of a bigger bomb than everyone else. That's why I'm at 5% uh, less fuel than everyone else. Um, and that's that. I'm hoping that's going to be enough fuel. This is quite a long trip. Uh, but I think this should be enough fuel. And then hopefully we'll be able to get there and back uh, without dying. <laughs> of course. So yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. So let's go ahead and jump straight into the game here. Alrighty then, here we are. in game, per usual. Let's open up the radiator just a tad. I am going to need flaps for this, of course, and we have been given clearance for takeoff, so let's just go ahead and take off. Now again, I'm hoping with me putting down to about 60% fuel, this will help us as far as performance on the takeoff part here. Um, and I know, the, I know the 65 is more than enough for the guys with the 500 pound bombs. They're going to be actually a lot lighter than they're used to, I'm sure. Alright, picking up that speed. And roll off. There we go. Nice gentle takeoff. Very nice, very nice, very nice. I think I have actually put it on the proper fuel amount that we needed for that. So we are airborne. Let's go ahead and retract the flaps. We're going to nose down just a tad. Um, as we pick up that speed that we lost. Ooh, not that much nose down though. There we go. There's that speed's back. Alrighty then. So we're up and away. Center of that track IR. Uh, yeah, we're up and away. 200 no uh, two knots. Ha! 200 kilometers per hour. <laughs> and, uh, climbing. So we are good. We are, uh, gaining altitude. So, per usual, I will cut the video here. And I will join you all when we reach the target or if we get pounced on by any enemy fighters. So until then, stay tuned. Oh! Whoa! No! Welcome back everyone! We're under attack! Ah! <laughs> My gunner is like, oh, oh, oh. watching bullets flying over my head. That's not fun. Gunner is attacking targets. Orders. Orders. I don't know. I don't know how I can tell their guys to open fire at the same distance my guys are. But it looks like they've all broken off chasing after the 109s. We're good. We're still at our almost designated uh, flight altitude, which is 3,000 kilometers. No, oh, are they coming back in? Don't shoot our other 109s, guys. Don't shoot our other 109s. My gunner. Ian, this is earlier? 
in the war? I wonder if Dimitri's in one of those fighters flying behind us. But anyway, if any of y'all remember the Spitfire pilot, Dimitri, or a Soviet pilot, flew in the Spitfire. I only wonder that because it was easy to shoot him down. <laughs> That's too good. Uh, because I got my freaking engine blasted out by a Stuka tail gunner. Alright, looks like we're still all intact. Doesn't look like anyone's smoking badly, so I think we're good. Um, I can bring the water radiator back down here. we got about 50%. Alright, well, we still have a little bit to go. So I am going to cut the video back here. Um, if they show back up, I'll bring you back in. But I think we're out of the fighter's reach. I think they all dive down. Um, they're probably chasing the 109s. The 109s will probably beat them up. So we'll be back in a couple minutes when we reach the uh, northeast. Oh, no. We'll be back in a couple minutes. Welcome back, everyone. Um, we're still good. <laughs> we have everyone. Uh, there is our target, so yeah, it is a little like temporary train depot set up, um, so the trains can drop off troops and such to the front line without actually having to go to a town and then being tricked over or whatnot. So right now we're actually over a bunch of AAA uh, barracks and things like that, or entrenchments. That's what the word I was looking for. AAA entrenchments. Uh, I am keeping an eye out for any enemy fighters still lurking around. Uh, I have a feeling that we're going to run into quite a bit on the way back um, since we'll be low to the ground again. And we'll be in prime attack position for them. Alright, I'm going to close that door. So we know where it is, it's right there. We're gonna wait a little longer. Before we roll over. We'll wait until I see it go under my wing. And then we deploy the brakes, roll over, and start the dive. Kabloomy! Whoa! Good Kabloomy! Well, of course, we put a thousand kilogram bomb in there. Throttle back up. Oh, yeah, I forgot to turn off parking, uh, parking brake. Dive brake. <laughs> well, whatever was there is not there no more. Whoops. So when I wanted. I wanted to inform. Tell my guys to. F3. I'm hoping they're all drop on targets. Not gonna tell me what I destroyed there. Quite a few stuff looks like I got there it goes. <laughs> Just say quite a few stuff looks like I got blown up there. Ow. Uh, they're ground attacking stuff with guns now. Okay, I can join in on that. Though there's enemy fighters real bo uh, real close by. Oh my goodness, look at the fire coming out of there. Okay, I'm gonna tell my guys, come <laughs> come with me. <laughs> guys, come back. Let's go. We're, we're not gonna stick around on this one. Especially with the fact that there's still fighters being called out.
let's just check. Let's see what we did here. Two machine guns, two stationary facilities, four transport vehicles. I'll take it. Well, we lost one. Triple A probably got him. Triple A is chewing up my guys back there. I probably should have took out the 18 kilogram bomb. The 1800 kilogram bomb. Did he parachute out? I don't see a shoot. Hmm. Is that another one of my guys going down? Oh no. Or was that our escort? I see two of my guys coming in. There's only four of us. Well, four of them. Five of us, I guess, in total. And you look like an enemy fighter coming in to strafe me. No, thank you. I do not want what you're selling. I do not want what you're selling. Go away. Go away. That is, that is an LA-5. Alright, let's be stupid here. Especially, I'm over enemy territory. I shouldn't be doing this. If it's friendly territory, maybe. Come on, one lucky bullet. That's all I need. That's all I'm asking for. One lucky bullet. Stuff's still popping back behind me. That's great. Oh, AI. There we go. There we go. I see the rounds breaking them. If I put all my ammo into you, I don't care. Go down! Ah! <laughs> That was for my friendly. All right, let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> How much? I still got half my ammo left too. That's insane. I'll take it. <laughs> uh, all right. So we're gonna run away. Hopefully, we won't run into any more fighters. Um, if not, I'll bring you back in. That is a Stuka. Oh wait, there's still... Oh no, that's right, we lost one. There's three of them left. Okay, cool. Alright, so we're on our way home. I will see you all, uh, either if we get attacked by more fighters or, uh, if we reach friendly territory when we're landing. So, until then, stay tuned! Uh, welcome back, fucks! We ran into another couple of aircraft. <laughs> no! Oh, they're circling around. I don't know if they spotted me yet or not. It looked like a couple of LA, uh, um... LA-5s. Not LA-5s. No, um, yaks. Looks like a couple yaks from a distance. Could be MiGs. What are the two? I don't know. All I know is that, uh, they're over our territory, so we're good if we get shot down or if we get our busted engine up. We can still, uh, land and be safe. Uh, they're attacking ground targets. They have not spotted me yet. That's nice. It's very nice. I want to go home. Uh, the only reason I'm going towards where they are at is because I want to get away from that bulge that we have to cross there. They are yaks. Okay, you know what? That's a, that's a aisle two. Wait a minute, I'm confused. Oh gosh. 
<laughs> there's like, I just turn around and look and there's like crap tons of stuff flying around. Okay, these are enemy. Yep. Alright, you know what I'm going to do? Orders. Just go for it, guys. Just go for it. We got ourselves into the crapper. Um, it's time to spend that ammo that we have. Wait a minute. That looks like a 109. That's a Stuka. Those are one of nines. Yay, friendlies! <laughs> oh, okay. Well, then I could tell my guys to follow me. Come on, guys, let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> oh wait, that's not though. No, another J, you went down. I hope that wasn't one of my guys. to me no 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 well good thing it was just the air system we're not up high <laughs> all right I guess I am gonna tell my guys to go back and start attacking air targets because there's no point in trying to do that we're stuck in a dogfight now come on little 109 buddies you've got to help us here Or what I can do is order my guys to RTB to get the heck out of here and I'll stay and fight until I can get away. Until I can think of something to get myself out of this, this pickle that I'm in. I don't know who that is, but break, 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 break towards me. We went from one fire into the other. You think it's over friendly territory, that is. Goes that guy that's been chasing me. No! Oh, 
Oh, about time you showed up. Alright. Break. Fly home. Fly home. Yeah, well, I'm not going up, so it's okay. Oh, no. Is that a 109? Ah, crap. Did he smash into the water? Tell me he smashed into the ground. <laughs> I'll take it. That was him. I'll take it. Maneuver kill. Take it any day. I guess we'll find out in the replay. Holy cow. Okay, the skies are clear. <laughs> as far as I can see. Yeah. All right, well, close can to be back in. All right, well, I am running home now. <laughs> now that I got myself out of that pickle, causing uh, yeah. All right, so, um, flying myself home. I will see you all when we uh, reach it. So until then, or if we get jumped on by anything else, until then, stay tuned. Welcome back, everyone. As you can see here, we are approaching the airfield. And we can enter this airfield in great urgency because if you look down here, oh boy, <laughs> we brought just enough fuel for uh, for that little little bit of fighting that we did. I'm hoping the engine does not cut out on me while we're making this landing. So we're gonna have to do this landing a little quick. Yeah, and I need to land more urgently than those guys do. So you see here, our air... Yeah, we we don't have any oxygen, as you can see down there. <laughs> no pressure at all. Um, it's all trailing out behind us. Thank goodness they did not hit any of our fuel tanks. Because that would have been bad. Go ahead. We're going to use the die brakes a little bit here to slow us down more. Track those. We're gonna put the flaps down. Good, good, good. Nice, steady 170, 160, 170 kilometers per hour. Need a little bit more airspeed there. There we go. So all but one of my guys made it back. No. Um, one of my guys, reverse that, one of my guys made it back. The rest of them all, I guess, went down in action, sadly. So a very sad day for this unit here. We lost a lot of pilots on this one particular mission. A little bit of a long, uh, a long landing there, but I'll take it. It doesn't matter. There's plenty of runway. Alrighty, let's get off the runway here. So, at least tail brakes. So that we can turn. We are down and woo, just woo, that was real close on the field. I thought I was gonna have to ditch for a second there in the little bit in the past. But anyways, landing was a success. So uh, we'll stop here and join you all in the debriefing screen.
All right, then. Welcome back. As you can see here, landing mission accomplished. We did a lot. We did a lot. Um, we shot down one plane, one LA-5, um, five vehicles, five transport vehicles, two stationary facilities. That would be the railroads, um, the platforms, uh, three artillery guns, or machine guns, essentially. That would be the AAA, and that was that. Let's go ahead and look at the flight log here. I have a sad feeling that we're going to see, oh, wow, 109, 109. LA-5 was destroyed. That was mine. That's everything blown up there. All right, one JU-87 went down over here. We watched that guy go down. Um, over here, a lot of 109s. This is our escort guys. A lot of those guys went down, and we lost one. Oh, no, wait, this was that fight that we got stuck into. We lost one there. So what happened to my other guys? Because there was uh, five of us. There's four behind me, so there's five of us. So where are my other two guys? There should be other, another two uh, Stukas out there. Well, one landed, so there should be another Stuka somewhere. Mm, I guess we'll find out here when we hit this finish button. All right, so surprisingly enough, we only lost one pilot. We lost three uh, through... Uh, well, I guess it would technically be two pilots, or a pilot and a gunner. Um, but other than that, and everyone else made it back, so they must have crash landed in. Uh, they either crash landed, they, they had the ditch somewhere. That's essentially what that was. So anyways, thank you all for watching. If you want to support the channel, I do have a Patreon. Link should be popping up on the screen at any minute. Or you can check in the description. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the likes button. The like button. Uh, if you're new here and you want to see more of this content, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon to be notified when new videos come up. And we'll catch you all next time.